Good morning, myself Shongor, my fellow teammates Ranveer Khetan and Shreya Srivastav. Our team name is Gaj Kavach. Coming to the problem. Now, understanding the problem. The rise in elephant deaths due to the train accidents is quite alarming and requires urgent attention. It is imperative to develop and implement innovative and technologically advanced solutions to mitigate these types of fatalities. Increasing power consumption, the railways in these areas reduce the speed drastically from 90 km per hour to less than 30 km per hour which, is, uh, which increases the power consumption hugely in the trains. The revenue loss. The chicken neck corridor, the corridor uh, within 100 km from China border, 45 km from Bhutan border, 95 km from Nepal border is strategically important for national security. Disruption in transportation could lead to significant security concerns. Now let's come to the solution. Firstly, monitoring with cameras. Our system uses a real-time monitoring and detection system which detects the elephant from approx 5.5 km to the railway tracks, ensuring to safeguard the life of both elephants and as well as the passengers traveling in the train. Secondly, we have uh, trained the machine learning model to make uh, the correct detection and accurate detection of the elephant uh, and also coupled it with an alert system. Uh, thirdly, uh, the warning mechanism, the system swiftly detects the elephant from the railway tracks, ac activating the warning uh, via walkie-talkie to the uh, nearest uh, uh, stations and to the local pilots of the approaching trains. Uh, now let us see uh, a demo uh, working uh, video. In these particular hotspots where the elephant and the train collisions are happening, we have integrated this type of system. Here is the camera and when in front of the camera an elephant comes, we can see that a signal is generated which turns the green, uh, green light to the red light. So this signal is then generated and it is conveyed to the driver of the uh, train so here is the progress so far. Uh, we have made the first prototype and also tested in the lab condition. We have won the state level competition that is the first prize and also approached uh, from DRM of APDG that is North Eastern Frontier Radiation Plan. We have used the following components ESP32 Lilligo, RS485, USB, USB cable and an old USB camera. Earlier our prototype was based on Raspberry Pi 4 but due to the current budget of Rs 1000 we have used ESP32 Lilligo. The AI programming resources that will be used are GitHub, TensorFlow, OpenCV libraries, Python programming language, AI open source forums. The only potential challenge which we have faced till now is this prototype has only been tested in lab situation and not in real life situation with real time datas.